This is the third time I've been to the summer school uh, and in each case I've given a presentation on blood-borne biomarkers with a view to obviously educating the uh, students and the postdocs who are coming to this uh, meeting. And I find it's uh, very uh, useful for me because I get to see young people who are making their career through science and uh, also the opportunity to possibly bring people in, into the lab in Manchester if, if what, what I describe appeals to them. What I spoke about were uh, picking up uh, clues about cancer from a simple blood test from a cancer patient. And what we actually do is we take apart the cells and the non-cellular part of blood and look at the DNA in the cells that we enrich and we enrich for tumour cells using markers that are only found on tumour cells and we also look at the cell free component of blood and extract all of the DNA and in both of those we look at uh, DNA sequences that tell us how uh, whether the tumour is detectable and if it is detectable what mutations can we pick up and are those mutations uh, sufficiently informative to help us work out better therapies for the patients. Well I think it's got a very good uh, basis uh, of invited speakers, that's not because of me but because of the other people who are part of this uh, uh, course and it's very well balanced so it, um, it does a very good spread from the actual practical clinical side of things, the epidemiology, uh, people who are involved in cancer all the way through the process from research to clinic and back again. Yes, I mean we, we collaborate and communicate. The collaboration is largely uh, communication and we communicate methodologies and findings to a large number of the people who attend the same conference and actually we have for some of those pe people we actually share grants so we actually take part in a European Union grant with uh, some of the uh, co-attendees of this meeting. Well I think education and cancer uh, go hand in hand and you, we've got to do this uh, type of summer school and we've, uh, I, I think it's very very important for the young people who are coming through the cancer uh, research area to get a view of all aspects of cancer research. And for me, uh, because I'm getting older now, what I'm trying to do is to link what I do as research as much as I can to the clinic to maximise the likelihood of what I'm doing having a benefit to the cancer patients. And I think more and more people are, are, are well, more and more researchers are doing that but still plenty of room for the basic research, but what you get a feel for in this um, conference is how you could translate what you see into something that could potentially benefit uh, patients.